take exactly a traditional path into financial services. Uh, I was actually freshly graduated from film school, had my master's in filmmaking, and was trying to make it in the independent film world, and that was proving very challenging. So I got a job on Wall Street writing training materials. I also have a degree in English, and it, uh, they needed somebody who could write, and I could. And I fell in love with the business. Never thought I'd end up in financial services, but delighted to be here. I think my creative background allows me to sort of First of all, think maybe a little bit differently about um, problems, but I, I also think that if you're going to resonate with clients, if you're going to actually help people, sometimes bringing a fresh approach, telling a story in a new way, I think that can make a real difference in their receptivity, helping them stay invested, helping them understand why this might be the right approach to, to go. These all are, are things that I think make a real difference when you bring creativity to bear on, on you know, professional challenges. You know, I think the biggest differentiator that Symmetry has is that we are consultative. We really want to meet the, the, the client, the financial advisor, where he or she is. So often, firms take the sort of approach of Henry Ford had, that you can have any color you want as long as it's black. And I think that's not very helpful. Because we take a consultative approach, we understand what the financial advisor is trying to do. With our 30 years of experience, the fact that we work with thousands of advisors and have helped so many advisors over the years grow and deliver a better client experience, that allows us to see what's the advisor trying to do and how can we best help them do that. I think the most important way we're helping Symmetry's clients is really freeing them up so that they can focus on what is most important, which is spending time with their clients and growing their business. And we provide them with materials, consulting, advice, solutions that free up their time. And this is really important because advisors know intuitively that their best and highest use is being in front of clients. Every day is different. And it's just, it's fun to spend time solving problems creatively, thinking about how you can bring new solutions, new services, new tools, new education to your clients. And what can you do differently today? The best advice I ever received was understand the impact of what you're doing. It's very easy to get um, especially when you're doing things like marketing. Oh my gosh, look at this great brochure we did. Looks so, so, so wonderful, great design, etc. But if it doesn't have an impact, if it actually is not helping people, then it, it was not really beneficial. And you really have to understand what you're doing, who you're helping, and why. And if you can't measure it, if you can't track it, um, you should really think about should you be even doing it. The biggest lesson I've learned professionally is never forget who your client is. Have deep client empathy. And that's so important because so often in, in so many businesses, it becomes all about me. It becomes uh, about the firm and what you do. And that's great. But if you're not actually helping your client, if you're not understanding the challenges, the opportunities, the goals, the struggles, the joys that they face, you're not going to be able to make a real difference for them.